how did he hurt himself? I don't know. I mean, it's he just hurt right here. Yeah, she's going to jail for the night. You want it? Right, yeah. Ah. Do it. Do stop. It. I'm dare you. Okay, stop. 911, ah! what is the address of the emergency? Yes, 1100 North Shore Drive, which is uh, northeast. 1100 North Shore Drive, northeast. In what city? Which is a, a resident, St. Petersburg. And the phone number you're calling from? My cell phone number. Exactly what happened? There's a, on the corner, there are buildings on the corner of 11, of North Shore Drive and 11th um, Avenue North. There's a guy who's been outside yelling and screaming for, he's arguing with his girlfriend and the other guy driving the car. They've been going at it for a while, then they leave, they circle, and they're arguing again, they're screaming, he's screaming at the top of sound like lungs. anybody needs a paramedic? Not a paramedic, no. I'm going to get you over to say, the police, come. hold the line, I'll speak first, and I'll transfer over. Yeah. Thank you, police. Champion, no rescue. Thank you, hello. What is going yeah. on? Nothing really. How, how, what happened to you? I just smashed my finger on the side of the phone. Oh, you smashed your finger on the phone? The phone, yeah. You broke the phone or what? The phone's broken, yes. It's on the back side. Regardless, he... I guess it's so we, be have, a, we have our... Uh, uh, like a supporter over here. That he uh, yeah. cut it right while he was breaking the phone, yeah. like the phone is going to say. What, um, I fell and scraped my phone with my hand. Okay. Since I got the tension to get it, I'll turn it out. She has blood from the. Okay. What's going on, ma'am? Okay. Listen, we got a call out here. Yeah, we're going to go to the hospital. Yeah, we're going to go to the hospital. We got a call out here, like, from, I guess, the staff here. Because you guys are out here screaming and yelling and arguing by your car. No. And he was breaking phones and whatnot. No. Well, he just told me he broke the phone and that's how he cut his hand. No. So. We went out to like downtown St. Petersburg. Okay. That was it. Okay. We were done. Okay. It was a calm night and then we came back here and then... Do you live here? Yes. You, you live here? Yes. Okay. Do you know the address here? Yes. What is it? No, I'm asking, I don't want you to look it up. I want you to tell me if you live here, what the address we is. We just recently, like, moved in here. Okay. My right. mom's resident. Okay, that's fine. So is you that live okay? here. Can yeah, I? Yeah, you live here, and how, but how did he hurt himself? I don't know. I mean, Where it's did he just hurt himself? right here. I mean, there's, there's blood, blood out here. So it clearly happened, like, out here in the street. What car do you drive? A Johnny, uh, Pontiac G6. Is it one of these around right here? Around the corner. Okay. Blue. Dark. Did, all right, blue. let me ask you this. Did he hurt you? No. Did you hurt him? No. Did anybody else hurt him? No. He did this to himself on accident. Is he just drunk and he fell or I don't, make me understand. How does that happen? I don't, I don't know. What did he hit? Did he like punch something, like the ground, or? Not that I'm aware of. Like people, like phones don't usually do that to people's hands. Oh my god. Okay. Do you have your ID on you? Yeah. Okay. You're good. Sit. How about you sit down before you hurt yourself? Just have a seat. Wait, I swear there was no. Okay, I believe you. I'm just trying to, but you, at the same time, you can't really explain how this happened. Is this yours? Is this yours? Ma'am, is this yours? You, you can stay there. Just answer the question. Is it yours? It's just a bag of leftovers or something. Um... 
Yes, it most likely is ours. Okay. All right. So you don't have to grab your ID out. I'll just get your information verbally. What's your name, ma'am? Caitlin. Caitlin? Spell it for me. K-A-T-E-L-Y-N. Last name? Last name, H-A-W-H-E-E. Hawhee? Yes. Is that you say? And your date of birth? January 14, 1994. And do you know your social? Yes. Go ahead. All right. And a phone number for you? From who? My, like my family? Like you, like I could call you. What is your phone number? Okay, what is his name? Bargoff. Hey, don't give my name. Yes, I am giving your... What, what is He's his name? Bargoff. Spell it. B-H-A-R-G-A-V-A-V. B-H... Bargoff. Spell it for me. B-H... B-H-A-R... Uh-huh. G-A-V. G A V E. G A V, yes. Okay. And what's his last name? Patel. P A T E L. P A T E L. Okay. Do you know his birthday? Yes. What is it? June. Twelve. Nineteen ninety. Fuck. I don't. I. Ninety three. You said. Yeah. Okay. And whose phone did he No, bring? he is like, like no, he is at least. Whose phone did he break, ma'am? Huh? Whose phone did he break? Was it his phone? He didn't break any phone. That's how he said he cut his hand. He broke his hand on a phone. Is it, are you guys like locked out and he got angry because you're locked out? Or like, what's the deal here? I, make me understand. No. People don't just miraculously get arterial You can call my mother. Why would I call your mother? She's not here. I'm asking you because what is going on. she's the owner here. of the apartment. You're allowed in the I apartment. I believe that. I'm trying to understand why you are out here and he is bleeding everywhere. I have no idea. It just, like just, he yes, just miraculously got God. an arterial bleed yes. in his finger. Okay. Hey. I'll be right back. Can you please let her know? No, we tried. No, you did not let her Stop. know. Do not pull away from Do not pull away. Stop. Mom! Stop. Come on. Come on. We're done. We tried. Okay. Oh, no! Come on. You're going to get another charge. <laughs> Stand up, Caitlin. You're being dramatic. Stand up. We tried to get you in your apartment. Stand up. Come on. You're just going to go and sober up at the jail, okay? Change of plans. Oh, you are so... You are so... Stand there for me.
Okay, we'll get it. Just don't let her fall. <laughs> Caitlin, stop <laughs> resisting. <laughs> the only person doing that to you is yourself, man. <laughs> Do, oh, not, do kick. not kick me. You'll take a misdemeanor. You'll take a misdemeanor to a felony real quick. There's going to be all straight to court. Okay. <laughs> I'll try to be you. Go to court. If you kick me, I'll kick you. Do not kick me. Do not kick me. Listen to me for a second, okay? We're still trying to help you despite all of this. I'm, listen to me. Calm down, take a breath, and listen. I'm going to take the handcuff off of one hand so that I can get your purse off of your arm. If you resist, you go to the ground. Do you understand? I suggest you stop it right now. Stand still and take a breath. Go ahead. I got that. You, go ahead. And, no, do this one. This one. But we're gonna have to tighten that one up anyway. She's gonna slip out of there. Alright, do not pull your hand away. Place. Probably, well, too late now. Alright, there's nothing illegal in my back seat. If I find anything illegal in there, the only place it could come from is you. Does that make sense? Alright, do you have anything in your pockets? I have to check your pockets real quick, okay? <laughs> Move your hand so I can make sure there's nothing in your back pocket. You're not being groped, man. Yeah, you know you were you're there. You're being searched. Like they were being groped us. You're being searched because you're going to jail. <laughs> I'm going to put your seatbelt on you, okay? I didn't do anything. Okay, face that way for me. Turn your head away from me. Why can't you breathe? Uh, because I'm like a claustrophobic. Okay, take a breath. I can't breathe. Should I tell her? Yeah, tell her. Let her know. Hello? Hi, um, this is Caitlin's mom again. Can you tell me what's going on? Yeah, she's going to jail for the night. Okay, what did she do? She was warned probably for about 30 minutes to stop yelling. So we brought her into the front of her apartment. She couldn't find the key to get in, and she continued to start yelling at us again, and then she pretty much tried to fight and score up on one of the officers who did not, and warned her multiple times to back up, and she said, no, take me to jail, and that's where we are now. All right. What did she do to the officer? She pretty much got in his face trying oh, to okay. fight him. Okay. How did you guys get involved in this? We were called because there was two people yelling and screaming out front of uh, the condo building and we showed up and there was blood everywhere, so that's why we're here. Alright, did you see him? Yeah, he cut his hand and Caitlin has told us nothing about what happened. 
So I don't know what she's told you, but she has told us well, she nothing. Hasn't, she hasn't told me anything either. Yeah, um, she. Did you get to talk to him? Yeah, yeah. He's he just said he got angry and punched the phone, and okay. that's all we know. And okay. th there's no criminal nature in getting mad and punching a phone. You know, there's nothing we can do. But she is claiming that we are lying. But that's that's the whole story we have. We have nothing else. That's all we have. And everybody was just gonna go home. He was going to the hospital. She was gonna go to the room. And she decided to try to score up and get in an officer's face. Okay. We gave her okay. like we usually don't give people this many attempts, but she yeah, is. Well, I understand, and I heard how she was talking. Yeah, she was. She's very, very intoxicated. But she's claiming she's not drunk, but she is. To one of the highest levels I've seen, where you, you at least you don't pass out yet. She's right there. Okay. Um, that's the thing I'm worried about, Caitlin. Is an alcohol, a recovery, well, I thought she was a recovered alcoholic. Um, I am worried about the alcohol level because she could get dangerously drunk. Yeah. So, the, she get medical care if needed? Yeah, she will. Pretty much so. What, what an arrest for a disorderly intoxication is, you're intoxicated, you're acting disorderly, they take you to the jail, they put you in pretty much like a drunk tank, they make sure you get your, uh, your water, you stay hydrated, and once you're out, you, once you're sober up, you're out in the morning. It's that simple. It's more like a, a, a babysitter for drunk people. You see that bad? Okay. All right. Um, okay. Well, we'll be up there tomorrow morning. So, um, we're two hours away in Fort Myers. So, um, tell her she should stop that. Will she be there so somebody can pick her up or help her out? Um, she'll be there probably until the morning, uh, and they'll probably either just release her or they'll give him give her a bond. So she didn't have her key to get in. The, uh, uh, I mean, at least she couldn't find it. Uh, we, we we were able to get her in the building. We got her to her door, um, and she could not get in her door. We were trying to help her get in her door. She continued to yell. I explained to her that if she kept doing her behavior that was waking up all the guests in the apartment that she was going to go to jail for disorderly conduct. She then proceeded to get about three inches from my face and dare me to, uh, so I did so. Um, we can't stand out here all night and give her warnings, unfortunately. Right, okay. Well, at least I know she'll be safe tonight, so that's probably the best place for her right now. Yep, yep, she'll be safe. Okay. All right. Yeah, I know, right? Uh, uh, where, where would I? What's that, ma'am? Can she call me in the morning, or can exactly someone call me and let me know when she'll be? Yeah, she'll be able to call from the jail. All right, thank you, my man. Okay. You have a good one, all right? All right. All right. Well, thanks so much. All right. I appreciate all your help. Not a problem. Sorry about all this. Yeah, me too. All right. Have a thank good night. Bye-bye. You. you too. Bye-bye. wants to be read her Miranda warning. I don't have any questions, so no. I told her that we don't need to. Yeah, if they're in our presence, it's so there's only intoxication. I don't think we need to ask people. Mm -hmm. Beyond done dealing with her. We're gonna do all that. What? Mm -hmm. That's all garbage. Oh well the the makeup can go. Yeah. Uh, when you truck I'll get another bag of pillows though. Yeah. Stop beating the inside of the car. Okay. Then let me out. No, we tried. I'm suffocating. No, you're not being suffocated. You're being arrested. Okay. We tried. I want, I we want tried. Charges. We tried and the tell whole my time. Family. With disorderly tell intoxication. Me you have not told me on what charge. Disorderly you intoxication. Have not After the. Disorderly. Tell me by formally. Tell me. What? Disorderly tell intoxication. No. I no. told your family. I told your mom. Disorderly intoxication. Oh, okay. Just like you just told me to do. Anything else you'd like to complain about? You're never fucking getting away with this. Okay. You're never fucking getting awesome. away with this. Awesome.
Unreal. She's got a bunch of miscellaneous pills here. I need to look up and see what they are. Well, this is for uh... so diazepam. Yeah. So the little orange ones in there are actually what's supposed to be in there. The yellow ones I haven't got are anything IG three twenty two. Was that like heart medicine or something? Uh, it's a muscle relaxer and it's used in conjunction with opiates a lot of times. Uh oh. So. Yeah. Propanolol hydrochloride. It's a high blood pressure. Not controlled. One fifteen H. Just peek at her. Yell that again. That's fine. You know. Okay. Oh, Danzatron. It's a nausea medication. So nothing to control? Good. Kaylin, you've been warned by him, and now I listen to me. No, talk to my mom. shut your mouth. You've been warned by him. No, you've been I did warned by me. Wrong to if you, you lay down and kick my windows again, I will pepper spray you. I, I did promise. nothing wrong to you, officers. I promise. Now. Do you, you understand? Just want control. Okay. I want if you a kick fair my window, control. You get trial. Sprayed. I want to talk to my mom. Okay. Oh, all right, spray. Kick him again and see what happens, ma'am. Here we go. You want it? Spray it, yeah. Stop. Do it. You can do stop. it. I can dare you. Okay, stop. <laughs> Four three delta OC deployed. <laughs> Just, just hang out over there so you can see her.